For general settings, you can open up the model checker configurator for Revit within Revit itself. You can simply come up here to BIM Interoperability Tools, look for the configurator, and click on Launch. When you click on Launch, your General Settings dialog box appears. Over on the left hand side is your menu options, and the very first menu option is General Settings. Here, you can create a new check set file. Here in check set properties, you can add in the title, author, description, and dialog image. Something to note here is that the title, author, description, and the dialog image here can all be seen by the user inside Revit for the model checker for Revit. Here in required optional checks, you can use this setting to activate or deactivate the required or optional setting for this check sets checks. The setting does not change the function of the checks. It just adds a visual indicator for the users. Up here in open, I can open up other checks that I previously opened here in recent. I can also browse to other check set files I have located somewhere on my computer or maybe in a server. Down here, I can look at my library. These are my check sets that I have loaded on my machine. Over here in the public library, which are downloaded from biminteroperabilitytools.com. For this example, I'm going to click on the Kobe extension. Here it fills in the title, author, and description, and then adds in that dialog image. Earlier we talked a little bit about title, author, and description, that this is what the users see inside Revit, but also this dialog image. The best size for this dialog here is 125 by 125. When you have your general settings set, you can simply click on save and this will save the current check set file and allow you to name it. 